Hello everyone, welcome back to Pear Tutorial. Today we're gonna find out how to install and use MultiMC. What is MultiMC, I hear you say? It's a, a Minecraft managing software that lets you have multiple instances of Minecraft easily available so you can uh, click in and click out. And now I hear you say, what are instances? Instances are for example, if you want to have a Minecraft, which is a specific one version, you can have that as an instance. If you want to have two Minecrafts with the same version, but one is vanilla and one is modded, then you can have that. If you want to have five Minecrafts with the same version, but they all have different mods, you can have that. And you can rename the Minecrafts instances, so you know which one is which. As you can see in this picture, you can have old worlds and stuff like that. There's a lot of things you can do with MultiMC. It makes you, it, it makes it literally one click to install uh, Forge and it lets you install mods ridiculously easy. So I highly recommend to get MultiMC. Uh, it works with Mac OS, Linux and Windows. And all you gotta do is press the download button. The link to this website is in my description and uh, it should open up uh, or it should download a file that is uh, um, packed, zipped, sorry, and uh, you have to extract it. Okay, so if you go to our downloads folder, we should have a uh, MultiMC here, MultiMC EXE, like that. And all you gotta do is ch uh, choose your language. Here it says completeness, which means that how much of it has been done and how much is like uh, still in progress. So of obviously the English ones will be 100%. So we just take uh, American English and choose our file and here we have multi MC working so as you can see my profile is blacked out all you gotta do to have your profile and what is a profile it's your minecraft account so what it, it will need a profile to open minecraft you won't get minecraft for free so you have to uh, manage accounts add a microsoft or mojang account I won't do it here because it's not needed. But uh, if you wanted to play with multi MC, you will have to add your account. So you won't get Minecraft for free with this. So you add an instance. And as you can see here, it has all the versions all the way to 1.0. You can e even add snapshots and it will add all the snapshots. And that makes the list a lot longer. It has betas and alphas and experiments. That's how old you can have it. So you can go all the way to an old alpha type and old snapshots. Yeah. But usually all you want to have is releases. So I just have it like this and it will have a star at, uh, to the nearest release. And uh, yeah. So you can just pick one, let's just pick the newest, like that, and you can launch it or you launch it offline. Uh, as I said, you need a profile to launch it, so you'll probably complain if I press. But what is incredible with MultiMC is that you can edit instance and you'll have this file, which is, I love this file. I love this window, I'm sorry. Which has a lot of buttons. You can install Forge, one click. Like that, okay, and Forge will be installed. If you go to, lo uh, if you go to, um, uh, wait, there, okay, now it works. He has the newest version of Forge right there. You press there and okay, and boom. That's how fast it was, and install Forge. You want fabric? No problem. Boom, fabric and intermittent mappings easy no need to go to a website to do that which makes me 
so excited. Uh, if you want to install mods, you just have the mods loader, and you literally go to like um, uh, just install a mod online, and then when you have the file, the zip file, you just drag it, drop it into here. So you just have like uh, the file explorer over here, and you just drag drop and put it in here, and it will it will work. Um, some of them needs Forge and Fabric, so just remember to install it, which is easy. But I have forgotten to install Forge for a mod and then wondered why it didn't work. Uh, it has Quilt also, which is also a loader. You can just install it for fun, since it takes two clicks. So that's pretty insane. You also have your shader packs and all of these just like available so you can see what you have. You also have your worlds. So you can just easily copy paste worlds so you can like store them elsewhere or if you want to have a world in a different um, different instance or different version. That will also work. And if you have like let's say you have 30 mods here and you just uh, add instance and make it a 19.3 you can just go over here and uh, rename this one to uh, mods or whatever you want obviously and it will have you have a vanilla version and you will have a mod pack version so this is some things you can do with multi MC and I really love this. So if you play with mods a lot and you want to like jump back and forth from instance to instance or world from world or mod from mod, I highly recommend multi MC. It makes modding, uh, like adding mods and shaders so easy. If you've learned something today, please press the like button. It helps out the channel a lot, and I'll see you in the next one. It's been fun being with you. Bye.